Today on Repairs 101, I'm going to take you through some of the basics of sockets and socket wrenches. If you work as a mechanic, you'll find that most of the hardware you deal with comes in the form of hexagonal or hex cap screws and or nuts. And of course there's exceptions like stove bolts and allen screws and butterfly nuts. But by and large, most of the hardware that you can encounter as a mechanic will be in fact in this hexagonal shape. Sockets come in 6 point and 12 point, which are of course hexagonal and double hexagonal. Black, which is a heat treated impact socket with very thick walls as compared to the silver version, which will just have, you know, a finished metal surface such as chrome or otherwise polished metal. It'll be a thinner and lighter socket for use with hand tools, as opposed to the impact sockets are used with impact guns, with impact wrenches. Socket wrenches come in a wide variety of sizes and shapes and are designed for various special purposes. Quarter inch drive wrenches are so called because their square drives measure one quarter inch across. They're used extensively by people in small engine repairs and component repairs. And you'll find a decent variety of the basics like extensions and universals, socket drivers. You can also use them as drivers for specialty bits like these tamper proof bits with the quarter inch hex drive on them. But honestly as a heavy duty mechanic I mostly only use this guy right here with a 5 16th deep socket on it for tightening hose clamps. I get a lot more use out of my 3 8 drive kit, and I imagine most people do, and that's why there's such a wide variety of adapters and specialty tools available. And you'll find a decent variety of basics like extensions and universals. 3 8 can take a fair strain before failure, but if you need to turn up the power, you really want to move up to your half-inch kit. I get an awful lot of use out of this fella. It does seem to be more specialty tools and adapters available for half inch drive even than 3 8 drive. And really what kind of specialty drives and specialty tools that you're going to carry will all depend on the kind of equipment that you work on. Now it goes without saying that your 3 quarter inch kit is going to be very expensive so you're only going to buy that if you absolutely have to if you're working in the heavy duty field. And so you're only going to be able to find very basic items for your 3 quarter inch kit like extensions and breaker bars and deep sockets.